Hello and welcome to the channel. This is Rachelle at Simply Honest Living and today I have our grocery haul and meal plan for the week. Starting off the week with some copycat Chick-fil-A sandwiches followed by a goulash American style. Then we're going to have an easy cheeseburger night followed by pork belly adobo and some chicken tikka masala to round out the week. As always, I invite you to subscribe to the channel, like the video if you enjoyed it, and tune in on Monday to see how I've used most of these items in our meals of the week. So without further ado, here is our grocery haul. Hello, good morning, very, very good morning. It is Sunday, Sunday morning, and I'm gonna jump in with the grocery haul. Just gonna start with the elephant in the room. I found it. Never before in my entire Aldi life, which is not really that long, but I have never, ever, 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 I have never, ever seen the red bag chicken. But they had it at my store this morning and they had a lot of them. They didn't have any of the other bag chicken. They didn't have blue, they didn't have green, but they had red, so I bought two because you just never know if they're ever gonna have it again. So I got two of these um, red bag chickens and then I also got two of these candles. Um, I hadn't seen these, uh, what do you call them, scents before. Coco Love, it smells like coconut. Well, duh, I'm not Coco. Oops, Coco Cove. Mm, smells like coconut and like, kind of like perfumey as well. And then this one is black currant, currant elder flower. So it's um, fruity, but then with a bit of floral as well. Okay, and then jumping in with the rest of the normal, the regular grocery haul, uh, we've got some avocados here. We have some uh, Baby Bella mushrooms. I think these were on sale for like 69, 65 cents, something like that, um, down from 95. Baby carrots for the dog snacks. We have some tortillas in the back for Colin's breakfast burritos. If he still likes those, I don't really know. I don't, he's been kind of like floundering the last week, so we'll see if I get to use those this week. We've got some brioche buns for, I am going to try to see if I can do the dupe for the Chick-fil-A uh, sandwich. So we've got the brioche buns. We also have two things of eggs because we are nearly out of those. Uh, these were Aldi finds in the refrigerated section. We have Parmesan and then they also had Asiago Classic. Um, Asiago, sorry. Uh, these were $3.99 each and it's quite a, a bit of shredded cheese. So I got that and then we have some applewood sm smoked bacon because we're out of that. Radishes. I'm really, 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 really trying to stay low carb keto so i am going to do some radishes for things maybe i will try to roast them in the air fryer and then we have some blueberries these were on sale i believe they were one i want to say 175 each and then there was a limit of two so i did get two these are nice and big so i hope they're sweet i hope they're sweet okay so that's this side here and then over here we've got some naan for like non pizzas and things like that out of the keto bread so i bought two of these um in the multi seed version um, we've got some well the two that go together we have crispy rice and then mini marshmallows for rice crispy treats i did get this this was i i don't I don't, I didn't buy this to eat it. <laughs> Although, you know, the guys can eat this if they want. Unsweetened applesauce. I am trying, I'm gonna try a, a treatment for my scalp. I read somewhere that you can maybe use unsweetened applesauce in your hair, so we'll see. I don't know, it may or may not do anything. And if not, the guys can definitely eat it. <laughs> um, we've got some creamy peanut butter because I'm always, I'm always dipping into the peanut butter with the, the keto bread. It's always like a good kind of desserty snack for me. And then we have some unsweetened tea for Rob. So that concludes the grocery haul. I will probably go ahead and fill in with another grocery haul this week because this was sort of an impulse after church. I decided, you know, I'm gonna pick up some staples and then I ended up getting some things that weren't exactly staples. Uh, so once I have the, um, the meal plan set, which you probably will have already seen at the beginning of this video. Once I have that set, I will run and do another fill-in haul. So that is the grocery haul for now. And total for today, $73.81. This is the fill-in haul for the week. Look at these sunbeams hitting the grocery haul like, oh, 
<laughs> um, Colin was sitting in the background eating his food. That's why I kind of set it up weird here in the corner. And then he decided to just get up and leave. So alas, uh, here is my grocery haul. Again, this is a fill-in. There were some, uh, a couple spontaneous things in here, but let me just jump in with some hamburger dill chips. I did buy, I'm gonna jump over here. I bought more chicken breast fillets. The red bag chicken is really good. So I did the copycat, um, copycat Chick-fil-A sandwiches last night. Really, really, really good. But I didn't have any of these pickle chips. So I bought some of those. I used spears instead and I sliced those. Back here, first impulse buy, a two-piece macrame plant hanger. This was, I believe, $9.99. Then we've got a uh, heavy cream, because I'm totally out. Texas toast uh, for tonight um, to go with the goulash that I'm making. For the goulash, I had to pick up some ground beef. Got two pounds or so, a little bit more than two pounds of that. Um, we've got some shredded Mexican-style cheese, because we are completely out of shredded cheese. Um, I've never bought this before uh, from Aldi, jasmine rice. I don't normally buy jasmine. I usually buy just a regular long grain white or basmati. Winston, stop, what are you doing? <sighs> Sorry, Winston's in the background there. Um, we have some onions completely out of, well, I have one more onion left and I hope this bag is good because the last couple bags, there were like one or two onions where when you slice into them, they're, they're like black inside. I don't know, so I have had to toss a few of them out. So I'm hoping these are okay. Um, we've got some green bell peppers. We have some more keto bread so I can have some in the fridge. And then I found the keto buns. Uh, this is the first time I've seen it. So I, I knew that they existed <laughs> just like the red bag chicken. I knew these existed, but I'd never seen them before. So this is the first time picking that up. Uh, another uh, impulse buy was this rosewater sangria. This was um, along with the Cocoa Cove and the, um, I believe it's like a black currant elderberry candle that I bought last week, but at this particular Aldi, they had this one as well, so I picked that up. Their candles are really good, $3.99 for a three wick candle, you know, whereas you'd pay like over 20 bucks at um, Bath and Body Works. So, and then the last impulse buy, the last thing I picked up uh, that was an impulse buy, this was $7.99, was this basket steak. Um, it's one of these things that you just stick in the ground and it holds, well, you can see there, this gives you the idea of a flower basket. I picked it up, it was only $7.99, and I thought it could hold the bird feeder, like the hummingbird feeder that I, I bought. I'm not sure though, because the way this hook is, kind of looks like, it could potentially like slip down or something. It may not even fit because this is actually kind of thick. So, but it was only $7.99, it has a cute little um, B on it. Uh, if it works, I may paint it because my uh, hummingbird feeder is like copper, uh, copper finish. But that is the uh, fill-in haul that I have here. Total, including the impulse buys, was like 68 and change. So this is the second bit of uh, the grocery haul video. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any questions, leave it down below. I will see you in the next video. And don't forget to check out the meals of the week on Monday where you can see me use all of these goodies. Okay, take care until then.